Hey everyone and welcome to today's video. So today is Friday, November 19th and I am very excited because it is the last day of school before Thanksgiving vacation and that deserves something to celebrate. <laughs> Throwing peaches off the chair to the tree. Um, so today we are going to make a drink. It is something that I've seen on TikTok. It's something that I've seen um, on other people's channels. It's something I've seen on Pinterest. So it is the fishbowl drink and I can't wait to get started and try it. So let's So the recipe says, and I am looking at sugarandsoul.co, um, coconut rum, and I've got some Malibu coconut rum here, some vodka. I bought a brand new bottle for this. It was cheaper. Um, some sweet and sour mix, some blue carousel, pineapple schnapps, sorry, peach schnapps, <laughs> pineapple juice, <laughs> um, club soda, <clears throat> club soda, Swedish fish ice, and then fruit, um, and optional is nerd. So the instructions on sugarandsoul.com say how to make a fishbowl drink. Fill a sh sh cocktail shaker about half full of ice. Add the rum, vodka, sour mix, pineapple juice, carousel, and schnapps to the shaker. Shake for 20 seconds. Add fish and ice to bowls. Arrange them so that the ice holds the fish against the bowl for presentation. If you want to get creative, divide the nerves between the bottom of the bowls. Strain the contents of the cocktail shaker evenly into the bowls, top with club soda and garnish with fruit. So combining that with the bread, booze, bacon recipe, um, they, com they suggest the pellet ice cubes like you get at Sonic or you can get it like Casey's. Um, I just have regular ice. So their instructions say, fill your bowl, fish bowl one third full of ice. If you um, give it a, pour in your rum, vodka, and blue carousel, give everything a stir, pour in sweet and sour, pineapple juice, and lemon lime soda, or club soda, we're going to use club soda, add ice as needed to fill the bowl, and create a good layer on top to hold fish. Um, they call for Swedish fish, but I don't like them, I don't like the taste, so we're not using them. We are going to be using gummy crawlers. You can put a handful of straws in the fishbowl. Um, since I am just making this for me, I went online and I found this cute fishbowl drinking glass. So we will be using it. So we're going to start with the common denominator, which is the nerds. And I've got a cup full of nerds here. And the nerds are supposed to be like the uh, rocks at the bottom of the fishbowl. So next, we're going to pour in some ice. Okay. So next comes our alcohol. So we're going to start with our coconut rum. I've just got some Malibu coconut rum here. I'm going to fill it to the bottom of the top set or top of there and pour it in. Now, the reason I just kind of, I you can definitely measure more correctly. Um, everybody makes drinks their own way. I kind of eyeball them. Then we're going to go with the vodka. Same amount. Okay. And I will give you a look at what that looks like so far in the drink container. You'll see about halfway there. Then we're going to add the sweet and sour mix. Give it a good shake. 
same amount. Then we're going to add the blue carousel. This, I am really looking forward to it. I have wanted to try it for a while, but every time I went to try it, I came down sick. And meds and a fishbowl do not mix. Next, we're adding peach schnapps. And yes, I had to buy peach schnapps specifically for this recipe. Mmm. That smells very, very fruity. Next, we're going to add some pineapple juice. And club soda. I'm putting them both in the cup at the same time. You can opt for lemon lime soda if you wish. I am going with club soda. There's my pineapple juice and club soda. That really took up some room. All right. So now I'm going to put in my gummy fit, my gummy worms. And I have sour bright night crawlers. And I picked up these and the nerds at Dollar Tree. You all know Dollar Tree is one of my favorite places to shop. Just put in a few handfuls of those. And then we're going to top off with some more ice. Get my lid and straw here. I'm going to use my straw to kind of give the drink a good mix. Put my lid back through my straw. Maybe. There we go. Okay. All right. Throw my trash away. And here is my fishbowl. All right. So now it's the moment of truth. Now we get to taste test. Wow, that's really tasty. Okay, so if you saw my videos in 2020 in October, um, you'll know that I made a drink called the Shark Attack, which is at Universal Orlando, and this tastes a lot like a Shark Attack, just a little bit bigger version. Um, this will take me a while to finish, and I will probably be sharing it with Sam. No worries there. But I... I love the color of the drink. That's a combination of the sweet and sour, the pineapple, and the blue carousel. And it makes such a pretty underwater, greeny, spooky color. You can see my nerds. You can see my little fish, at the, my gummy worms at the bottom of the bowl. That is tasty. And the perfect drink to start off my Thanksgiving vacation with. So... Thanks so much for watching with us today. Let me know in the comments below, do you plan to try to make a fishbowl? And like I said, the links that I'm using, um, I will put in the description below along with the link to the fishbowl cup that I bought from Amazon. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you tomorrow with a new video. Bye everyone.